Hello everyone and welcome to this video on Citrix ADM Intelligent Application Analytics. Citrix ADM is a solution which will help you orchestrate, manage, monitor, automate and troubleshoot your entire global application delivery infrastructure from a single unified and centralized console. It also provides rich analytics for application health, performance and security and simplifies overall app lifecycle management. Here is a quick overview on ADM Analytics offerings. To this analytics suite, we are newly adding Intelligent App Analytics, which we will be looking at in this video. Now, we all know that an application performance issue can impact business negatively. That is, a low performing application can lead to business loss. Hence, it is very essential that an app admin identifies the application performance issue and reaches the root cause in a timely manner. He needs to answer three questions. What issue happened? Why did it happen? And how can it be resolved quickly? Now, this is exactly what Intelligent Application Analytics helps with. Let's look at this with the help of a use case, which is server response time anomaly. Every application behaves differently and has different response time expectations. In a big server farm, it becomes a very time consuming and tedious task for admins to assess each application, understand their response time expectations and set these individual thresholds for server response time across each app. Intelligent App Analytics helps assess every application in its own context. Leveraging the server response time indicator and using machine learning, it helps identify abnormally high response times and abnormally low response times. It not only identifies the low performing app and the root cause of the issue, but also gives recommendations to resolve the issue. Now let's log into Citrix ADM and see how intelligent app analytics is helpful. When I come to the app dashboard, with the help of color coded application, I see that the accounting application has a low performance score. When I drill down further into this application, I see in the app activity investigator that out of the other issues, there is also an anomaly highlighted for server response time. You can hover around one of the anomalies and drill down further on any of them to see that it is clearly highlighted across a timeline chart. You can further magnify that chart to see the details. When you hover over it, it clearly gives you the details of the anomaly. It reads, this service's response time increased by 125%. Median response time changed from 3 millisecond to 8 millisecond between 1539 and 1554, which is a 15 minute window. So this was the anomaly which ADM identified and it also gives you details on the application, the related service, the Citrix ADC IP address and the severity of this anomaly. So you've identified the problematic application, the exact issue, as well as ADM gives you certain recommended actions to correct this particular issue. This was a quick glimpse on how intelligent app analytics helped an app admin identify a server response time anomaly. In general, intelligent application analytics helps an application admin answer these three set of questions. What happened? That is, it identifies the low performing applications. Why did it happen? That is, it highlights the root cause of the low performance. And how can it be resolved? That is, it recommends certain actions to resolve the issue. This feature has inbuilt intelligence. The algorithm which it uses is refined, validated using customer data and fine tuned to make it optimal. In terms of detection, it not only helps detect an abnormal increase, but also helps in abnormal decrease detection of the server response time and it avoids false positives, that is, it discards the spikes. Intelligent Application Analytics supports the following use cases with the help of either machine learning or statistical models. They are 
server response time anomalies whose video we just saw session build up and service flaps thank you for watching this video please leave in your comments thank you